Kelsey, you are fearfully and wonderfully made. And in you, I found a good thing. And I found great favor with the Lord. And I promise to cherish you like a precious jewel that you are. Kelsey, you're altogether beautiful. So I promise to remind you of that when you forget. And I promise to hold you closely when you won't believe it. Kelsey, you are clothed in strength and in dignity, just like the Proverbs 31 woman. So I promise to challenge you, chase the dreams that God places on your heart. You open your mouth with wisdom, and the teaching of kindness is on your tongue. So, Kelsey, I promise to listen when you speak. Christ has given me an example to follow, so I promise to continually be learning to love you as he loves the church, and continually sacrifice myself day in and day out. You're my best friend, Kelsey, but more importantly, you're my sister. Therefore, I vow to you to do everything in my power to draw you near to our Lord so that I can help you to see him one day in heaven. And now I give you these vows so that you can cling tightly to them, so you can open this up and remind yourself so that we can both be reminded of the biblical truth and the godly love that our marriage will forever be founded in. I love you, Kelsey. Two years ago today, I had no clue that I would become your wife and you my husband. But just a short time later, I had a pretty good idea. From the moment we met, I knew there was something special about you. You had and still have an excitement for life and for doing God's work that's contagious. Since then, you've inspired me to be better and to love so much more deeply. Also, I'm so excited that I get to love you forever. You're my best friend, and I look forward to sharing all of my days with you. I know that in those days, there will be plenty of ups and downs, and I promise to be there with you through all of them. I promise to try my best to make you laugh each day, even if you're laughing at me. <laughs> I promise to work together with you as a team to come out stronger on the other side of our struggles. I promise to continue learning about you every single day. I promise that I won't criticize your dreams, but I'll support you. In them. I promise to serve you, not out of obligation, but because I want to and I get to. I promise to love you, and when life gets hard, I promise to love you some more. I promise to always work towards having a heart of compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. And I promise to help you do the same. I love you so much, Austin Ainsworth, and I'm so excited to finally be your wife, best friend, helper, sister in Christ, and teammate all of I now joyfully pronounce you husband and wife.